of such a great program, a statewide partnership has increased food security and encouraged local food production in the Ocean State. It's amazing what a big difference a little seed can make. And joining us today to explain it all is URI Seed Incubator Program is Kate Venturini Hardesti. Good morning, Kate. Good morning. Thanks for coming in today. Thanks for having me. So before we even get into this program, this is all part of, uh, of the URI Cooperative Extension, right? And can you just kind of like explain what that is? Sure. This We're part of the university that actually works outside of of the campus okay. so we serve consumers in Rhode Island businesses um, and we have a lot of a lot of things people can take advantage of that are free right. and this is a great example of that and this is a program that you folks have also teamed up with. Look, we all love Job Lot. Oh, yeah. Job Lot, you can find anything at Job Lot, and they have kind of reached out and are helping you along with this program, which is so important mm -hmm. to people who, who, need, who need food at this time. Yeah, it's been really great since COVID, especially. Um, actually, we weren't getting as many seeds from Job Lot during COVID because people were buying them, which was great. Right. But instead of sending these back to Burpee to be incinerated because they are expired, we take them, they, Ocean State Job Lot, the Charitable Foundation actually donates them to the university. And then we have really almost 100 people who literally stand and sort them by type right. and then take orders from the public. And so this wouldn't be possible. I'm here representing it, but it wouldn't be possible. There's many people involved and Job Lot makes it all happen. Um, but we're really honored to get these seeds out to the community. So you, you mentioned that uh, these seeds would go, you know, be basically tossed away because of expired, but they're not truly expired. They can still, you know, you can still, you plant these, you're gonna get beets, you're gonna get tomatoes, you're gonna yep. get cabbage and to feed, to feed someone who need it. Needs That's it. right, and it says on the bottom packed for 2023, um, you're st there's still gonna be a cherry tomato that comes up. They're just not as many seeds will germinate. Got it. But so this program has, has been around for, for a while, and it was extremely successful last year. Mm -hmm. Tell us about the anybody, like who really can reach out and get these seeds and who you kind of like service. Sure, it's you. Right. You could put an order in, um, anyone in your family. So individuals are welcome to order. Um, teachers, if, if you want to start a school garden. That's great. Do it put an order in, um, churches, any any community group, um, you can order more. We have limits just to make sure that we can share the bounty, if you will, but right. um, consumers, churches, schools, um, even businesses, and um, the seeds will also be available through food pantries and at almost every library in Rhode Island. So if you go to a library in Rhode Island and they don't have free seed display, ask them to get involved next year. That would really help us out. So now the other cost, is this free for folks who want to come in and get these seeds or is there a cost or do you can you make a donation? How does that all work? Glad you asked. Okay, so, See, that's why I'm here. <laughs> so organizations who are local can pick up their order Okay. Um, and we just ask for a $10 handling fee. It's, you know, it costs money to do this, sure. but um, it, you, everybody else can have their uh, seeds mailed and it's a quarter a packet. Mm -hmm. Um, and that helps us keep this going. And so I just want to shout out to the uh, Master Gardener volunteers who helped make this happen and um, to all the people who love growing food. Right. It's really important. So, uh, Kate, if anyone's watching, when do they have to put their order in and where do they go to put the order in? January 13th. Okay, clock So ticking. it's 10 days. Right. January 13th. They don't make exceptions. Okay. I asked if we could. No seats nope. for you. 10 days. <laughs> 10 days from today, um, orders have to be in, and um, what was the second part of the question? Uh, I forgot, but, uh, oh no, where can you go? Uh, so go to uri.edu. Actually, it's easiest to just Google URI Free Seed Program. Okay, So and that'll come up. That'll come up. That'll come up. It's a great program. Thanks Thank so, much, so for, much for coming in. And hopefully folks uh, take advantage of all of these great seeds. Yes. And, you know, grow some beets. I love I love beets. Butterfly Thanks. weed. Yeah. <laughs> also <laughs> nice. <laughs> Careful. Uh, <laughs> all right. More about URI Greenhouses and the Seed Incubator Program, you can head on over to our website. That is roadshow.com.